Okay, so I didn't expect to be wearing the jersey uh, because when you when the jersey's on, it means the Jets won. Listen, what are you gonna do? This team, they they win when they shouldn't win, and they lose when they should win, and and so forth. Uh, but you know, listen, they first of all, you know, and we're talking about the Washington game here, right? The I mean, Washington had a really fucked up start to that game. And at the same time, uh, you know, the Jets were having a good game. Listen, they were up by 20. And then in typical Jet fashion, they had to make it, you know, they had to make it a typical Jet game where they blow a 20-point lead. Uh, but they pulled it out. So, uh, you know... <laughs> I don't think it fucked the draft up too much, but it, it it hurts their draft. But you know what? As far as the draft goes, sometimes where you fall in the draft, you know, sometimes it's better to not be focused on just, all right, I want the number one pick or, you know, sometimes, you know, look at what happened to the Texans, right? They, uh, if I'm not mistaken, the Texans... They had the number one pick, and they told, they fucked it up by winning the last game of the season. They and they took themselves out of the number one pick, right? And what happened? They they wound up because they were number two. Uh, they went with Stroud because the Panthers take Bryce Young, right? And that leaves Stroud number two for the Texans when you know because the Texans. They played to win, and they, they fucked their draft up. They fucked their draft up, and they wound up with Stroud. So uh, that's what I'm saying. So I don't, I'm don't. i starting to not be as bent about the draft as I used to be. Like, I mean, I'm still a little bent about the draft. I still want high a high pick because you can do things with a high pick. Uh, but sometimes, like I'm saying, it's you, – it's, Maybe it's not a bad thing that they, they they beat Washington and maybe they'll beat you know, I don't think they're I don't wanna I don't wanna get into the Brown game. But it just like tipped off my prediction there, I think, right? And I didn't even predict the the Washington game. Uh maybe I shouldn't predict any of these games because I didn't predict it and they won. Um Honestly, when I when I go back and think about it now, it it you felt like they were going to beat Washington, but I didn't I didn't think Washington was going to come out uh and start that bad. Um everything was going everything was going wrong for Washington in the beginning of that game. Uh So, listen, it is what it is. It's a win. Uh, good for the morale of the team, I guess. Um, Jermaine Johnson had a good game, and uh, Brees Hall had a really good game. So, you know, that block punt was really sweet. Um, and then, like I said, they blow the 20-point lead, uh, typical Jet fashion, and, uh, and then they pulled it out. So, But just to break uh, these guys down just a little bit more, you know, like I was saying, Jermaine Johnson, he had the he had the block punt, which was sweet. Uh, he also put a lot of pressure, you know, on the quarterback and just created a lot of pressure in this game. And I, I've been saying it uh, throughout this season, really good to see Jermaine Johnson uh, emerging uh, this year because he has he emerged this year. Um, and it just makes that epic draft that much more epic because he was the one who wasn't flashing yet, you know. Uh, Garrett, Brees, and Gardner, they flashed right away. Jermaine, you know, took him a season to start hitting stride, and I only think he's going to get better. So it was really good to see him. And he had a strong game in this game. Uh, and then Brees in this game, right? Uh, he had some really nice runs and he had that one touchdown where like he spun around and he, he like just put the, he tucked the ball over the, over the goal line while he was like still in the air. 
Um, so he had a really good game too. He, you know, just pretty much all game. So, um, you know, I did say that this would be a short video. I mean, I said it, I think in the pregame, uh, that was a pretty short pregame coverage of this game as well. Uh, we got the Browns coming up on Thursday night, right? And, uh, I'll be putting out a video for that very shortly. Uh, let me just throw this out there as well. And I, I kind of have started to throw this out, but um, I'm going to start working on some other videos uh, when I get a chance. You know, the season's almost over, uh, but I want to still put videos out, you know, in the off season and stuff. So I got some ideas um, right off the bat, off the top of my head. Uh, look for, I will, I will be putting out, I'll definitely put out a video once the playoff bracket is uh, like, you know, locked in and we know who's in it and, and who's playing who. I'll definitely put out a video or maybe I'll put out a couple of videos covering the playoffs um, where I'm just predicting the playoffs. That would uh, that's that should be cool. Right. Um, and all the way up to the bowl. So, and then I, there's a couple of other videos I want to put together as well. There's, uh, and I've mentioned this in other videos, but I have an idea for like the, uh, you know, like a, a video where I just want to show you some of the evolution of the channel, of the Jet channel. Uh, I think that would be kind of a pretty cool video. Um, and then, like I said, there's a series I want to make where we talk about the design behind the team's logos and, you know, I'm going to cover each team, uh, but that one will take me, you know, don't look for that to really start for a little while because uh, that one's going to be a lot of work. That's 32 teams, right? So it'll be 32 videos, and I want to try to do that, you know, pretty good. So, uh, you know, and then we got the off season, we got the draft. We got, to, you know, we're going to see what's going on with this team. Uh, another video I think I want to put out is another, I want to put another video out about Zach. Uh, because, like, seriously, where what's up with, you know, this dude's future with this team? Um, you know, because he did have that great game. But, you know, I'll put, a, I'll put a video out. I have thoughts about it of really what I think is going to happen with, with that whole situation. Another video I think I want to put out as well Uh is I want to go back to when this team was looking for a quarterback, you know, way back early preseason when they you still didn't know where this team was going to go, what direction, and you had the Rodgers talk, but you still had Derek Carr available and all that. I want to go back to that again. Uh, and I'm going to – I want to pull up – I'm going to make a video about this as well, and I want to pull up some some of my old video – of when I was talking about that back then. And uh, I want to touch upon, you know, just something that as this season has gone on, it has, it has basically just pissed me off more and more uh, that this team didn't consider this guy. So, uh, all right, that's it. Um, it is Christmas night. I am filming this on Christmas night. So, Hope you all had a very Merry Christmas and uh, a great holiday. And look for the Brown video to come out uh, right off the heels of this video. So that pretty much sums it up for the Washington Post game. All right.